You put videos up on YouTube and you keep getting hit by copyright. This isn't to avoid the whole copyright thing on YouTube, but this gets you help when you just need a bit of music and you've got a copyright issue with it. You have to cut out that bit that you can't use when you're talking on it. How are you watching? Greetings, welcome back to my channel. This is DJ Funky Mike. This is a free quick hack for you about YouTube. If you remember about a year ago, up there is the link. I put a video up for how to avoid copyright on Facebook. And while it still works, maybe it's not quite as worked as it did because they changed their algorithm, it does still work if you use it. However, this video isn't about that. This video is about YouTube because the other day I put up a video and I got hit by copyright. Here is the email that arrived when I uploaded the video to say I can't use it. And this was literally the other day. And there you go. That is the message from YouTube as well saying I can't use it. Bear in mind, a copyright strike now isn't a violation strike. It's just a copyright strike, really. It just means that if you're over a thousand sub like mine, if you look down there, you see 1,785 as we speak. Which reminds me, do subscribe to the channel because you never know what's going to come up next with me. Um, Yes, so anyway, that was important, but it had to be in there. And so I had to go back and think about this and what I'm going to do. And I thought long and hard, and I thought, oh yes, my copyright thing for Facebook. Would it work on YouTube? A bit of an alteration on it. And I put it into the video. Now, let me show you. There we go. This is the actual video here, and I could even play it as well. He says he can play it. I don't mind doing his life. Nobody knew about it. That's for me, the bride. And the third, nobody knew about it. And if you listen very closely, you can hear something in the background, but this clip was only probably 15 seconds long. That was it. And uh, with YouTube copyright now, they'll hit you on about two or three seconds. So I put a little bit underneath it. Now, if I just turn down the main track on here, you will hear what I put in the background. There we go. If you can hear that nice and clear. So I just laid that underneath it and it completely stopped it. I run the video through again and it uploaded absolutely no troubles at all. Even I was surprised it done that one. Very surprised, but it did. And that was it. It's as simple as that. Now, put the link down below there. It takes you onto Dropbox and you can download it. But if you do do it, please remember to subscribe to my channel because you know, if it's for me, I've saved you a bit of time and hassle and you can upload your videos. Remember, this isn't to avoid YouTube. I don't want loads of messages of people saying, hey, you shouldn't be using someone else's music. I'm not doing that at all. This has nothing to do with this. But what you can do if you have a short clip and you don't want to lose out on the copyright on it, lay this underneath in it and I guarantee it absolutely works. What can be better? And that, that was it. That is the video for the day. I do hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much. And I say again, please subscribe to my channel because there's some more hacks coming up. Until next time, my funky friends, this is DJ Funky Mike, working on things for you guys out there. Thank you, bye.